Do you realize how much time and money you're wasting in your music career? And by the way, it is not your fault. In general, the music industry does not want you to know what I'm actually about to tell you in this video. Because if you actually understood this information as an independent artist, you would never be paying thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars and waiting weeks, 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 and weeks to get your songs back. So here's the deal. If you're not currently producing your own music, then you are sincerely missing out on tons of money and time. And in this video, I'm actually gonna take you into my computer and show you exactly how much money you are losing by not producing your own music. So if you wanna make an extra 10 to $20,000 a year by producing your own music at home, then stay to the end and I'm gonna show you exactly how you can start producing your own music and actually get it done way faster than any other option out there. So let's dive into it. So when it comes to making music, there's two routes that you can go on, route A and route B. What we're gonna do is we're really gonna dive into the weeds and I'm really just gonna break down exactly the numbers. I'm gonna show you some case studies and I'm gonna show you some options for how you can learn how to produce your own music if that's what you wanna do. So let's start with outsourcing. Let's start with just how much it's going to cost for instrumentals, okay? So the first, actually we'll use black. So let's just say, for example, that instrumentals are going to cost you. And look, by the way, we're talking about exclusive unlimited rights. So we're not talking about beat leases that are $20, $30 where you don't own the rights. We're talking about you own the rights to the beat. You can get as many streams as you want. And you're the last and only artist who's going to get the beat. And it's customized. So on an extreme, extreme, extreme low end, we're just going to go ahead and use the number 250. Next, let's go with studio time, right? So I actually worked, um, I was working on an album a few years ago and I went to like a pro studio. The guy charged me 35 an hour. Okay. And we're going to use that as a conservative number. So let's say it chart, it takes you an hour to record a song. And so let's just say, you know, it'll be $35. Uh, and then mixing and mastering, you know, generally speaking, like Again, on the extreme conservative, low, low, low end. <laughs> Let, let's say that uh, you're paying like 100 for mixing and you know, let's say you're spending 50 on mastering. Cool. So obviously in the producer on music realm, you know, when you do it yourself, this is obviously all free. All right, because I suck at math, 250 plus 35, plus 100 plus 50 cool okay so 435 dollars i mean dude that's on the fucking that's on the fucking low end like but let's just use this number for an example all right all right so here's what i'm gonna do we're gonna stick with this 435 number i actually want to take you to some some folks that i have personally worked with so i'm gonna first talk about my client ryan b so Ryan B is a guy I've worked with. He started out working with me with no prior music production experience at all. He, uh, rapper, songwriter, that's it. Um, and in the last three months of us working together, this is what he's been able to accomplish. So he made 30 beats. He's recorded five songs that of course he made the beats to them. And then one of those five is already mixed and mastered. So we just got to do the math. So 30 beats times $250. For recording time, that's gonna be $35 for the recording time. And then mixed and mastered is times, we said 150 for a song. So for Ryan's totals, if we were to do the math, again, we've got 30 times 250. Okay, that's 7,500. So let's just remember 7,500. We've got 35 times five. That's 170. Okay, so 170. So 175 plus 7,500. All right, and then we've got you know plus 150. So 7,825. I mean that's fucking sick. So if you really sit here and just think about Ryan and where he's at over the last three months. On the very conservative, <laughs> man, God, like on the conservative end, this is how much money he made, right? He didn't have money come into his bank account, but what he did was he was able to take, get this money back by not spending it in all these places. 
So that's pretty pretty insane, right? That's fucking that's fucking nuts. And by the way, four of these songs recorded four new tracks this month. So four of them he got done in a month where he made the beats. So that's pretty sick. I'm gonna use another example. So this is one of my other clients, Devin, and he, he actually just got started with this program, but this is what he's been able to accomplish in four weeks. So in four weeks, um, he's got his first song produced, written, and recorded, right? I fucking love Rapid Fire and what you're doing here. I think it's a beautiful community education. It's dope as fuck. I'm excited to see what you uh, where you take this thing. Sky's the limit, go get it. And then here's the song. Now, I'm gonna use, for right now, I'm gonna use our conservative numbers he hasn't had he's mixed it so instrumental studio time and mixing so he's at 350 plus 35 385 bucks but but devin actually personally told me hey man i used to spend around a thousand dollars per song he was paying he was paying 1k to get his songs done and in just four weeks he's already made that back and he's got, he works 40 hours a week, tech, has to take the train to commute, has a baby and a fiance. He's got personal responsibilities and he's still getting this done. That's pretty sick. So one of my other clients, Carlos, this is an insane story. Carlos used to, ne he had never even made music. Like he had told me that his music experience was singing in the car and singing in the shower. He went from that, no music production experience as well, and just so far, he's barely been in the program, but he's already made six beats. And his first song that he's ever made in his life, he the first song made the beat, recorded, and has already mixed it, right? Hey guys, I've been in Rapid Fire for about a month and a half before joining, never made a song or beat. This is my first beat I made. I've made five beats so far. And then he went and made um, that beat plus these five beats right here. I know the beat making contest is over. We had a beat making contest. But here are the beats I made in the past two weeks. One, two, three, four, five, plus this one is six. That's insane though, think about it. Made these beats in two weeks. Yo Carlos somehow missed this, these beats are fire. It's insane, less than two months ago, you hadn't even made a song, now you're fully producing. So let's go ahead and just do the math here. Six beats times 250, and then one song produced, um, so he had, that's recording time, and mixed, right? So mix is 100, 135, right? Because he had to pay for, he would have had to pay for studio time and mixing. So let's do the math. 250 times six, 1500. So 1500 plus 135, 1635. Off just being in this program for like just about two months, less than two months, right? And he's obviously making new music. He's making a reggaeton song. I think that's this one right here. He's going in. And remember, no production experience, no music making experience. And again, we are looking at extremely conservative numbers, extremely conservative, right? Let's, let's take this for example. Let's say you just want to pump out one song per month. Okay, let's use that example. What would that equal? So we'd have to do it. 435 times 12, $5,220 per year. Right, and that's not including marketing or anything like that. And that's on the low end. Now let me ask you this. Realistically speaking, when you make 12 songs that you finish releasing, how many beats do you literally get? Do you get 12 beats? No, right? These are just the songs you've released. That's the truth, right? Like honestly, like just keep it real. Every time you put out a song, that's one song, but how many beats did you have to get? How many beats do you have in the vault? How many songs do you have written and recorded in your vault? You gotta really think about that. So let's just go ahead and say this. Let's say for every one song, I mean, dude, we're gonna keep this super conservative. <laughs> let's say for every one song, it's two beats. So let's say it's 24 beats. Let's just say it's 24 beats, all right? 250 times 24. <laughs> That's $6,000 on just beats. Okay, we then have to go and add up. Okay, well, if 12 of them are studio time mix and mastering, I mean, I'm just like overly proving my point at this point. I'm just beating a dead horse and I wanna do that. Studio time, so we would do 150 plus 35. We're gonna do 150 plus 35 times 12. 
150 plus 35 okay 185 times 12 <laughs> it's two thousand dollars so this is going to be oops so this will be recording mix and master um for 12 songs what was the number we said two 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 zero this is a fucking joke dude all right both of these numbers is i don't even need the calculator for this because i'm smart eight So this is more of the realistic number you're, you'd be spending per year if you wanted exclusive unlimited rights beats. And that's that's the big caveat right there. There's a lot of you guys watching this show like, well, I just buy lease beats. It's all good. I buy lease beats. You spend $20, $30. Do you think you're going to make a legit music career off spending 20 and 30 bucks on beats? You're fucking playing yourself. So let's get into how you can actually learn. Like there are a lot of different ways to learn, right? We're going to compare and contrast all of these. So number one, the first one's obviously what? YouTube University. So price is free, that's awesome. Um, I, I actually learned how to produce music on YouTube and asking homies, but guess what? It took me about four years and I was working four to five hours a day, every day, Monday through Friday for four years straight to start making really good music. It took a long, long, long time. And that was after seven years of writing, recording, releasing and marketing music. So that's a long, long time. So it's free, but time-wise, you don't really know how long it's going to take. It could take a long, long time. Likelihood of achievement, you again, you don't know. You don't have a guarantee. You're just going on YouTube searching. You, you have no idea how long this is going to take. So there's your option. If you want to go learn it for free, good luck. Try it. The other option is music universities. So these are universities like Full Sail University, SAE Institute, um, LA Film School, Stuff like that. So I know for a fact, I've actually gone on a sales call with uh, Full Sail University. Their online program is $16,000. It's two years and they do not have a guarantee. I've asked them, hey, is there a guarantee by the end of this? Um, so there's no, so you can try that again. You can go to a music university, it's 16 grand. You can also, by the way, get a student loan, but who wants student loans with the interest they have? And you can't default on student loans. So 16K, it's gonna take you two years no guarantee. You also don't hundred percent know what you're going to learn, right? Now, what are the other options? What are the other options out there? How are you going to learn this stuff? Right? So I've actually got another option for you. So the other option is rapid fire music Academy. So what is the rapid fire music Academy? So this is the Academy that I started in January of 2023. And this is how I've been able to help all those clients that I was showing you before, you know, not only learn how to achieve creative freedom fast, but look at how much money they're earning by not working with producers and how much time they're saving. So it's really, really simple how this works. So the first phase is gearing up, right? The first thing we talk about is mindset, time management, learning how to produce a high quantity of high quality and battling resistance, which is like the stuff that's really getting in the way of most artists. Next is hardware. I'm not buying you the hardware. I'm just gonna kind of explain to you, hey, this is what you need. And all you literally need is a computer and your home recording setup, microphone, audio interface, headphones, cables. You probably already have this stuff if you've been doing music for a while. So you really don't need any extra stuff on the hardware side. Software, you need a DAW, Logic, Ableton, FL Studio, Pro Tools, something like that. And then your beat making software, right? Drag and drop sample library, automated sample library generator, and an AI chord progression generator. This stuff's pretty affordable. I show you all of it in the program. There's actually a YouTube video. If you go to my YouTube channel, I can actually show it to you right now. Yeah, so if you go to my YouTube channel, you can go watch this video, Produce Music as a Beginner, and it shows you the six tools you need but we also talk about it in the program. Then the next phase, make a beat, right? Pretty simple, right? First thing you're gonna do is start with a melody. Drag and drop with pre-made sound libraries and AI chord progression generation, right? Really, really simple stuff. You don't need to know music theory. You don't need years of experience. Next is drum and bass. You know, I'm gonna show you a drum, how to get drums and 808s from a library from big time producers like Murder Beats, Boy Wanda, Sunny Digital, 808 Mafia, and a lot of others. It's in multiple genres, not just hip hop, rap, and R&B and pop. They've got singer, songwriter, rock, metal, all that stuff. The next part is arrangement. How do you make sections of your beat, right? And pre-mixing your beat so that it's kind of a shortcut so that once you actually get into the main mixing phase, your beats are already pretty much mixed. And then phase three is mixing and mastering. 
vocals, how to pre-mix your vocals and set up your recording session once and then always have your vocal sounding professional. Then once you get into mixing, you import your pre-mix vocals into your pre-mix beat, add some final touches and you're done. Song is mixed in less than 90 minutes. Then of course, mastering, import your final mix, set up your mastering preset once and your songs are gonna be mixed and mastered in just 15 minutes. And the other cool thing, so in terms of time-wise, in terms of likelihood of achievement, this is what I have. So I actually have a guarantee for this program and here's what you get in two months, or I'm sorry, in three months, you're gonna get two things. Number one, you're gonna have at least one song fully produced, mixed, mastered, and engineered by you that you're excited to release. And number two, you're gonna have all the skills and tools you need to never need to buy beats, pay for mixing and mastering, or rely on producers ever again. And if at the end of three months, both of those things are not fulfilled, then I keep working with you for free until they are. So if that's something that you're interested in doing, then all you have to do is click the link below and book a call with me. It's really simple. Pricing's customized. Hop onto the call and see if it's something that you're ready to do. My recommendation would be get on the call if you're ready to enroll. And if you're like, if you watch this video and you're like, okay, dude, I'm fucking convinced. Like I wanna do this, click below. If you're not quite convinced and if you're kind of like, eh, I'm not really sure, what I recommend is go check the other videos on my YouTube channel and kind of sell yourself because the point of the call is I don't want to sell you. I don't want to twist your arm. Um, I'm not going to push you. I'm not going to press the issue. But that does mean that I want to get on the call with folks who are actually ready to go and ready. So if you go click the link below, you can actually see the price when you click that link below. And I do have some payment plans available as well if you want those too. So anyways, hope you found this video helpful. I hope this kind of opened your eyes to show you that you are probably wasting thousands of dollars and a lot of time waiting to get your songs back when you really could just do it yourself. And here's an option to get that done. So I hope this helps. Click below if you want to book a call. And uh, I'm excited to chat with you. And I'm excited to see you on the next video. Thanks so much. See you next time. Peace.